Hey everyone, this is John Rollins, here today to show you our 2014 Ram 2500. This is a mega cab, it's a big horn package, four wheel drive, has a 6.7 liter Cummins turbo diesel, flame red in color, and it's loaded with options. You've got a power sliding rear window there. They did put, obviously, the uh, Moto Metal wheels on it. You've got a spacer. You've got an MBRP tip on the exhaust, but the exhaust is stock. Nice tinted windows, running boards. You've got tow mirrors. They debadge the door so you don't have the emblems on the doors, just to give it a, a little cleaner look. Front fog lights, tow hooks, nice chrome grill. Just a beautiful truck. It's got a nice stance. Let's go ahead and take a look inside of it. You've got the diesel gray interior, full power options. You've got front bucket seats. You've got a power seat. All the seats are in beautiful shape. Nice big center console. Headlight controls. You've got a tilt wheel. You've got steering wheel audio controls for your radio. Now this truck does have the cold weather package. You've got a heated steering wheel. These buttons on the side here, that controls your dash readout so you can go through and change everything. On the right side, that's for your cruise. This truck has 56,427 miles on it. It does have a tire pressure monitor light since they put the aftermarket wheels in it. You've got the 8.4 inch Uconnect, so you've got the big touchscreen radio. And there's your climate controls. Factory trailer brake controller. Again, heated seats, heated steering wheel, traction control, tow haul, factory exhaust brake. You've got a 110 outlet right here in the front as well. Your four wheel drive controls are right here. You've got a nice big center console. It's split, so it's divided. You've got a change holder there in the front. You've got an SD card, USB, and auxiliary input there for your radio. You've got a big console down here at the bottom. In your overhead, you've got your power sliding rear window control. And these three buttons up here, that's a home link, so you can program your garage door openers at your house to your truck. And this is why everyone loves these mega cabs. You've got so much room back here in the rear. All the seats are in beautiful shape. These seats do fold completely flat into the floor. I'll show you that here in a second. Here's another look at your dash. Here's the rear seats folded down completely flat. You can see just truly how much room you have back here. Also behind the seats, you've got these storage trays. It's got a divider, but you can take that divider out. It runs all the way across. So you've got even more storage inside the cab. As you can see, the seats are a 60-40, so you can flip one up, flip them both up, you know, keep them both down, however you like it. Makes it very, very handy. This truck's got a nice spray-in bed liner. There are no holes anywhere inside the bed. Really no dents. Both wheel wells look absolutely perfect. The truck still has the factory exhaust. It's got this nice tip, but you do still have the DPF filter. You do still have the EGR on it as well. So if the truck has any remaining factory warranty, you still have warranty with the truck. You've got a 20 by 12 Moto Metal 972 wheel. You've got Toyo AT tires. They're open country ATs. They're a 305 55 20. Tires do have some life left. Looks like they're about 50%, so you still have plenty of life left. Just a nice stance. The truck also has either a two or a two and a half inch spacer to bring the wheels out. There are no odors in the interior. The headliner's in beautiful shape as well. This is just a nice, clean truck. If you're looking for a three-quarter ton diesel, and you want one that's been very well taken care of, this truck does not look like it's worked a day in its life. Super, super nice. We've got two glove boxes here on the passenger side. 
This is one of the big features that you can see if someone actually has a Bighorn truck or an SLT truck. A lot of guys will have the uh, Tradesman packages, which are the base models. The Tradesmans do not have this top glove box. But a lot of your dealers don't understand that, so they'll advertise a Tradesman as a SLT truck, and you pay more for the truck than what you really should pay. 6.7 liter Cummins turbo diesel. As mentioned earlier in the video, truck's off stock. We've got a stock air box, stock exhaust, we are still in the truck, the truck sounds great, starts right up, no blow by whatsoever, again my name is John Rollins, thanks for watching my video, if you're interested in this truck, please give me a call directly at 614-563-9999. I take trades, I have financing available, and I do have nationwide shipping if you're out of state. Thank you.